Dating, when it comes to the opposite sex, it can certainly be a headache. And even after you land a partner, it might not ever go away. That's why we're facing the truth today. Erin, Erin has a question for us. What's your question, darling? Hi. Hey. So I was in a three-year relationship. Okay. And we talked about marriage. And then a month after our three-year anniversary, he came over and basically sat me down and said, I only see you as a friend now. <gasps> basically out of oh, nowhere. Wait a minute, where is this guy? I'm gonna find him. <laughs> 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 yeah, so I was blindsided. I had no idea at all. At like, all? Wow. Yeah. Wow. And he had said he had been thinking about it for a while, which hurt me because I had always been so honest. Mm. So my question is, um, are there any signs? Have, can you tell if someone's literally falling out of love with you? And mm. how can I like trust anyone? Again? You know, again. All right, well, we're gonna start with <laughs> someone who is engaged. Jared, how do you feel about that question? I mean, if you're asking for like signs of them falling out of love with you, I'd say lack of touch. If they're not touching you really anymore or mm. showing any type of intimacy, then that's definitely a bad sign. Dr. Yeah. Judy. Don't want you to get discouraged. This is one person and he probably should have communicated better. Yeah. And you need to take a little reset, just a little time for yourself because if you start mm -hmm. dating right away, all that baggage is gonna go on to the next guy who doesn't deserve it and you may actually ruin something by being overly insecure and not communicating your feelings since you're trying to protect yourself. So I say at least three months, just the, the, reset, the, yeah. reset, reset, I like that. and then don't take your baggage into the next room. How about you, April? Do you have any tips for Aaron? So it's not about you being blindsided. When we use the excuse of being blindsided, it's when we ourselves are checked out. So it's your responsibility. If you can do that and never check your brain at the door and you are always watching the signs, like touch, has he stopped talking about the future? Has he stopped uh, being curious about you? These are signs that somebody is falling out of love with you because they've literally lost interest in the union and you can see it and feel it. It's not their words, it's their actions. And now would you, if you were in a relationship with someone, would you then tell them, I've noticed that you, 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 you're changing just a little bit. Would yeah. you confront them with that? Absolutely. And just straight out ask them? Absolutely, yeah. but you, you're not always going to get the truth. Okay. Mm -hmm. You have to trust your own instincts, mm -hmm. right? It's not about trusting again. I knew I met my partner, my husband, because I trusted myself. I trusted my own instincts and my own decision making. Also, you know, people don't give enough credit to relationships. Some relationships are seasonal. Sometimes it's a year, six months, They say months, that there's years. a reason for a it season. It doesn't necessarily mean that it didn't have they value yeah. just or, because it didn't go the distance. Right. Or, or maybe he has some deep, dark secrets he ain't yeah. telling you. <laughs> yeah. And we could just leave that up in the air because, you know, we can't say everything on TV, but maybe he's... <laughs> yeah. And Eric, if I, if, I can, if I can say, that sometimes that rejection is your protection, to be yeah, very honest yeah, yeah, with you. Yeah, yeah. And just don't be afraid to move on. But like I said, take time, like Dr. Judy said, reset, so that you can meet someone. Oh, you hurt, you little eye, no. you sure? <laughs> Hello, I was like they was watering up just a little bit. Yeah, you're, you're a so lovely, fun. lovely lady. Thank you. Take a little time, reset, spend some time by yourself. You know, that one didn't work out, and look forward, yeah. okay? Yeah. Yeah. All right, right, thank you, Aaron.